ask, you know, how should we build software that interfaces to these things? What's the user interface model for these Bluetooth connected gizmos? One of them was a bicyclist. And he got really interested in the idea of having a Bluetooth module sort of duct taped to his phone where he could go out and exercise and record his route and plot it on a map and show it to his friends, show it to other bicyclists. Well, that was the birth of Sports Tracker. Sports Tracker uh, was, again, a backwater application. Only a few people really knew about it. It was, was great for demos. And we asked, why don't we just release this to the internet? Undoubtedly, there are other people who would love to use this kind of functionality. Maybe we'll learn something from it. Well, we did. We put it out on the internet within the first two months with zero advertising. We had 100,000 downloads. Now we're up to about 850,000. Again, with no advertising, all word of mouth. Fabulous feedback from the team. The team has gotten really excited and motivated from the feedback that they've gotten from users. And they've incorporated that into new versions of Sports Tracker, and we continue to improve it. It's in it. And if you have an N95, you can download it through the catalog. It's really a great little piece of software. 